This is the oi. It's a bike bell. It doesn't look like a bike bell because we don't want it to be just like any other bike bell. Hi Richie, uh, I'm Hugo Davidson. I'm one of the founders of NOG and um, uh, we're here to talk about the oi bell uh, and what, how, we, how it came about and what we're doing to actually get out on the market. Um, so if you can tell us about the initial process of how sure. the OI came okay. about. Well, what we, uh, as, a, as a design company um, and as a, a bike brand, mm. um, we tend to come up with a lot of different ideas for different products. We've designed a lot of lights. Uh, mm. a, a lot. Know, a lot. <laughs> and, and a lot of them have been successful, some more than others. Um, Probably about six, seven years ago, one of our partners, one of our distributors has said to us, you know, you should look at bike belts. I have a particular design philosophy where I like the idea that products that we develop are, are not, they don't shout out, I'm a light or I'm a bell or I'm a lock. They, what we want them to do is actually be really sympathetic with the bikes. Mm. We want them to actually reflect the personalities of the people who ride the bikes um, and to make it look like it's part of the part of the bike. I love the simplicity of it and I think that's part of it and, yeah. and trying to actually get the quality of sound um, to match the, the aesthetic um, it was a really important part of it. So getting a signature, a signature sound mm. um, was, uh, you know, it was a key. It's the same when we, when we make our lights. Um, the flash patterns and things are something that we want to be able to look at a bike coming towards you yeah. and you can go, ah, oh, it's one ah, of our lights. Yeah, it's a knob light. Yeah, <laughs> because people recognise it and understand it. Great. So personality is more than just the aesthetic. It's yeah. about the sound, it's about the look, it's about the light, it's about the technology. And, that's it. and I think uh, Chris, which we'll have a chat with soon as well, can tell us a bit more about the sound and yeah. how it sort of... He's the, the sound more, specialist. Yeah, the, the insides yeah. of how the oil actually works. Exactly, yeah. Hi, my name is Chris, a designer here at NOG, and the uh, developer of the new Oi NOG Bell. Initial um, idea was, you know, how could we make a uh, cylindrical bell that, um, you know, wasn't, didn't exist, and started off as a simple sketch, not too dissimilar to what it looks like now, a ring on your handlebar. And I guess the challenge with that was trying to actually make, make it ring. So what we did was starting, started by cutting up bits of rings and metal pipe, rather, and seeing if we could uh, get a sound from them. So within the process, we uh, managed to have bells starting to ring. This one made from a handlebar that we, was uh, what gave us, after a long time of testing, some hope, which only gave us very, very small noise. But the issue was, if we were to hold, how to hold that on the handlebar, so if you hold it in your hand, nothing, nothing from it. So we tried many ways and many different, many different profiles to even get uh, a volume that was obviously loud enough. Um, and so we went through a process and came up with very interesting results in terms of materials relative to thickness, widths, and diameters. And so as you can see here, as an example, is. We have two sizes of the Oi Bell, one uh, that fits 22.2 millimeter handlebars okay, and yep. also a larger Oi Bell which fits uh, 31.8 wow. millimeter yeah. bar and it also fits 25.4 and 26. Oh great, that's yep. perfect. Kickstarter, we're the founders of NOG. I'm Hugo and I'm Mel. And back in 1877, John Richard Dedicote patented the first bike bell. Until then, nothing much has changed with bike bells. So NOG developed the Oi. We wanted to reinvent what the humble bike bell was. We wanted to design a product which was sympathetic to all bikes, looked great on vintage bikes, and looked really good all the way through to road bikes. And with your backing, we can bring this bell to life much faster than we normally would. So please pledge your support for the knob, OI. Get in quick, get one for yourself. Please share the campaign with your bike-loving friends. OI! <laughs>